Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we will learn how to estimate the sum. So let's get started. Here, estimation is nothing but it is an approximate or close value to the correct answer. We, it is not the correct answer, but it is approximately equal to. For example, here I have a picture. It, in this picture, a herd of sheep is seen. Here I will not count the sheep. By looking it, I will just say there are around 20 sheep in the picture. That is approximately equal to 20 sheep. I can find approximately equal to 20 sheep. But when, we, when I count it, I will found 17. So 17 is rounded as 20. 17 is rounded up to 20. So I will say 17 is approximately equal to 20. So this is not exactly by counting, by just looking it, looking at it, I'll estimate the number. Now, same like, likewise, we will estimate the sum. Let us learn it. In our previous video, we learned how to round off the number to its tens and hundreds. Here, in today's video, we are learning estimating the sum by rounding it off it into tens place. So I am taking an example to just just to recall. Here I have an three uh, I have a three digit number 348. So I am rounding it off to tens. So 48. 8 is in the right side. So we are rounding up the number. 348 is rounded as 350. Hence we say 348 is approximately equal to 350. Okay, now let us estimate the sum for two digit uh, number, three digit number and four digit number. Let us start with a two digit number. Here I have a two digit addition that is 28 plus 14. Here 28 is rounded as rounded up to 30 that is 28 is approximately equal to 30. And 14 is rounded down to 10. So what will be the estimated sum? That is 30 plus 10 is equal to 40. Hence we say the sum of 28 plus 14 is approximately equal to 40. Understood? Let us see one more example. Here I have 52 plus 46. Here 56 is rounded down as 50 and 46 is rounded up to 50. So the estimated sum is 50 plus 50 is equal to 100. Hence, the sum of 52 plus 46 is approximately equal to 100. This is the approximately equal to symbol which is very very important to keep in mind. Instead of this symbol, we should not suppose to put the equal to symbol when we are estimating. Please keep this in mind. You always write the approximately equal to symbol. Don't use equal to symbol when estimating the sum. Okay, let's move to the next example. We have a three digit addition here. Three digit sum 677 plus 325. Here 677 is rounded up to 680 and 325 is also rounded up to 330. Now the estimated sum is 680 plus 330 that is 110. Hence the sum of 677 plus 325 is approximately equal to 1010 is approximately equal to 1010. Next, we have a four digit number that is 3810 plus 4028. Here, 3810 is rounded as 3810 3, only because it is already rounded off to its tens place. So we are not changing this number. Then 
the next number that is 4028. 4028 is rounded up as 4030. Hence, the estimated sum is 3810 plus 4030 which is equal to 7840. Hence, we say 3810 plus 4028 is approximately equal to 7840. So, children, this is how we estimate the sum by rounding off its tens place. In the next video, we will learn how to estimate the difference by rounding off its tens place. In further videos, we will learn to estimate the sum and difference by rounding off the hundreds and thousands place also. Hope today's video helped you in knowing the estimate in estimating the sum better. Please like, share, subscribe. Thank you.